Good morning, everybody. It's me, Dana, a.k.a. Triple C. Welcome into Craft Out with Triple C. Hello, everybody. I'm super excited to be here. Thank you all for coming. Thank you all for hitting that thumbs up and the subscribe button. It is a pleasure to have you all here for this craft hour. If any of you are new, hello. Welcome to my channel. I'm Dana, a crocheter of 23 years. And I have a business called Creatively Creative Crochet. And you all are welcome to take part in that business on my website, or if you're interested, I do have patterns, the one like I'm wearing, which is called Aaron's Capelet. You can find it on my Etsy or my Ravelry shop as well. All those links are in my description or my About tab as well. So if you want to go over to my About tab, you can check out my Etsy links, my Ravelry links, website links, and so much more. I'm sorry about that. I did not have my notification and music and sounds off. <laughs> but yes, come on in, everybody, please. Let's, let's join the fun. I'm super excited to have each and every one of y'all here. Um, what I want to start off with is a prayer. After I do the prayer, I'll go ahead and greet everybody. So everyone come on in and check each other out. If you do need any subscribers or uh, help with your channels, I'm asking you that you please type the letter CC. And one of these amazing members will drop your link. Now, again, please get connected with each other. I always welcome everyone to get connected. Um, if you need just a few more subscribers and say, hey, or let someone know, hey, I grabbed you up. Could you please make sure you grab me back up? We have some amazing members in the building, and I'm super excited to announce Many of our members will be hitting some amazing milestones this month. Congratulations in advance. I'm going to go ahead and get to the prayer so I can greet everybody. I would love to greet everyone that's here in the building and get caught up with everyone, uh, do a bit of chatting and share a fun craft for today. So let me go ahead and get to the craft, guys. I mean, let me get to the prayer, guys, and I'll get, greet everybody. Thank you all again for being here. Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus, I come thanking you and giving you all the glory and all the honor for another day, another opportunity, and another chance to fulfill your will, Father God. I thank you, Father God, for just waking us up and breathing life into us. I thank you for every blessing. And I thank you for every lesson. On today, Father God, I'm just asking that you wrap your arms around us and keep us covered. Keep us protected, Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus. I come asking some special prayers for my Maria's at Elizabeth Aaron Crochet to bless her, cover her, give her traveling mercies as she's going to be on the plane traveling the highways and byways. I ask that you just help her and bless her and cover her family right now in this tragic time as they'll be ready to be welcoming and sending her mother on home to you, Father God. I'm asking that you just cover her soul, protect it, Father God. I'm asking that you just love on her. She, we, we, we would decree and declare that she is a believer. She will be a, a believer, and her soul will be saved, Father God. I'm asking that you wipe every tear from the Harold family, from the McKinley, McKinley family. I'm asking that you touch them all right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Cover them, protect them. And know that trouble don't last always. They will get through this the grieving process. They'll be able to gather. We bind up any type of division. We bind up separation. And we know they'll come together during this time. So I'm asking that you to cover them right now, Father God. Lift them up and encourage them. God, I'm asking that you cover everyone in this chat. Every man, woman, boy or girl under the sound of my voice on this morning. I'm asking that you touch our finances, our homes, our children, our vehicles, our businesses, our channels. God, I'm asking that you touch our pets. I'm asking that you touch anything that we touch our hands, God, that we put our hands on. God, I'm asking that I'm calling forth prosperity. I'm binding up lack. Mm. I'm calling forth power. I'm calling forth strength. I'm calling forth love in this season, God, and I'm thanking you for it in advance. I'm binding up backlash and retaliation over this prayer, and I'm thanking you, God. I'm thanking you for what you're going to do. I know what you're going to do because I know who you're, what you're capable of doing. I know who I serve, God. And I thank you. I'm asking that you cover those who are on the roads on today, Father God. Touch every vehicle. We ask that you cover them from any hurt, harm, or danger. We bind up mechanical failures. We bind up police stops. We bind up accidents. We bind, we bind up slide-ins and slide-offs. I ask that you help them get to their destination safely. Father God, protect those truck drivers, those semi-truck semi -truck drivers, the bus drivers, city bus drivers, as well as the school bus drivers. Protect them as they're on their way to work. As they're on the roads, cover them right now, Father God. I ask that you help them get to their destination safely, Father God. I'm asking you to protect those who protect us, who risk their lives daily, Father God. I ask that you protect those who are doing service every day, Father God. I thank you. I ask that you protect those who are in the hospitals, every doctor, every uh, medical staff, Father God. I ask that you just keep them covered as well, God. In the mighty name of Jesus, God, I thank you. I thank you. I thank you, oh God. Thank you, Lord. Mm. I thank you for everything that you're doing. I thank you for everything that you've done. I ask that you protect this chat from any spamming. We bind up spamming. We bind up 
cyberbullying, and we bind up trolling right now in the mighty name of Jesus. We bind up technical difficulties. I ask that this chat run smoothly, Father God. I thank you for this platform. I don't take it lightly. So I thank you for bringing everyone here. I thank you for the fresh ideas. I thank you for the blessings. I thank you for every donation. I thank you for every bit of increase. God, I know it's because of you. I know it's because of you. So I thank you for blessing your children to be a blessing to others. God. I know your word says, given it shall be given. So I thank you for your word. I thank you for your word. It says, no weapon formed against us shall prosper. So whenever weapons try to form against us, whatever try to obstacles try to come our way, Whatever negative negativity tries to come up, I know that you will block it. As I know it won't it won't prosper. It may form, it may get in the way, it might show up a bit, but it will not prosper. So I believe in your word and I trust in you, God. I thank you and I praise your holy and set apart name in your son Jesus' name. I pray this prayer. Amen. Amen. Come on in, everybody. Welcome in, everyone, to Craft Hour Triple C. Sandra D is in the building. Good morning, Sandra D. Hello. Sandra D is one of our amazing platinum squad members. That's right. She did the upgrade all the way up to the Platinum Squad, that's correct. Welcome in, Sandra D. Hello, how are you doing? Thank you so much for being in the building. If you do not have Sandra D, I ask that you please subscribe to our channel. Her command is exclamation mark Sandra D. Let's go visit her and let's push her to do some great things. And, she, and she'll be pushing us as well. Let's see Life and Stitches, a.k.a. Stephanie's in the building. Hello, Stephanie. She's one of my amazing, amazing members as well. She's on the Pearl Squad. She's doing some great things on our channel. And she's starting off so, so great. What I like about Stephanie is that she's starting off and she has a motivation and she's getting all kinds of things ready so she can be the best Stephanie. I love it. Go grab her up, guys. Her command is exclamation mark live. We have the beautiful Crojo Corner in the building. Welcome in. Crojo's on that titanium squad. That's right. She's on the titanium squad. So if you uh, want to check out Crojo, I would, I would really appreciate it because her channel is amazing. Not only does she have an amazing channel, but she has an amazing website. That's right. So we want to get everybody over to our website where you can purchase our delicious planner, which I just got to share again. Ta-da! This planner is amazing, guys. It is like a workbook planner, and I've been writing goodies in there because I'm working on a new pattern as well. Crow Joe has actually, uh, actually inspired me to start this new pattern, and so I'm doing it in the... I have my notes in here as I go along. I love it. It is a crochet planner, so many of you can grab that up. I don't know... I'm hoping Coach will drop that link so anyone can grab it. Feel free to do that and support this young lady. Her command is exclamation mark Crojo. How are you, Crojo? I cannot wait to celebrate your big milestone of 1K. I'm ready to celebrate, Crojo. We have the beautiful Granny D in the building. I knit Pearl and Squirrel with Granny D Thompson. And she says, hello, darling Dana. <laughs> hello, Granny D. Now, if you don't have Granny D, this is the perfect time to grab her. Because today, we get to go to her house at 5 p.m. Eastern. And she hosts a great time we're talking about beautiful yarns beautiful trivia beautiful knowledge and a beautiful group of family that we can all greet and have some fun to see it's so so fun over at granny d's house so let's go over there today at 5 p.m eastern time and if you miss it please don't miss it but go over there friday as well at 5 p.m eastern and if you're a weekend type of person check her out at 3 p.m eastern on saturday and sunday hey granny we love you her command is exclamation mark granny and she's on that latin and pearl squad we love you granny d Miss Geraldine is in the building. Hey, Miss Geraldine. Hope you're having a beautiful morning. I thank you for all your support and all your love. I thank you for everything that you always do and being such a motivation and inspiration. Doing my patterns. That feels really, really good. I appreciate you all. Oh, snaps. There goes Linda Simpson. Welcome in, Linda Simpson. Linda's on that platinum squad. If you don't have Linda, please grab her up and show her some sweet love. She is truly, truly amazing. She has a giveaway going on right now. So I'm asking you guys to please take part in that. All right? Take part in what she's doing because... You're going to love it. And uh, she has beautiful patterns that she tests for people. She tested so many of my patterns for me. I, and she brought them to life. So thank you, Linda, for bringing my stuff to life. Because uh, that can be a little hard to bring people's patterns to life. But you do. You know what yarns to pick. Um, all those types of things. So thank you for that. Y'all grab her up. Her command is exclamation mark Linda. And she does live streams on Wednesdays today at 12 p.m. Eastern. We can go to Linda's house. Isn't that going to be fun? Let me know if you guys are going to come and join me. Over in this house today at 12 p.m. Eastern. I'm excited to be there. So y'all be there with me, all right? Let's see here. I'm going to see if that Nana Michelle in the building. Come on here, Nana Michelle. This is beautiful. Nana Michelle crochets. Now she's working on getting to 300. Let's see um, where everybody's at. I'm going to be going through and uh, be working on all these different channels. Um, some people have won different things. Some people have been getting their channels uh, 
you know, different things we've been doing with people's channels have been a blessing. And uh, so we're going to be ex ex uh, we're going to be celebrating Nana Michelle's newest newest um, milestone soon. She's officially at 279. So we're going to be she needs about 21 guys, 21 to get to 300. So if you don't have Nana Michelle, please grab her up. Her command is exclamation mark Nana. So if you guys see any type of night bots in the chat, don't worry. That's when we drop commands. That means we're dropping links in a quick way. Um, we don't have to worry about trying to go copy and paste. If you are a member and you're on Golden Up, you get your own command where you can just drop it. You don't have to worry about trying to copy this link, paste that link. You can just drop your command and Nightbot will drop it for you. So if you see Nightbot dropping links, please click those links. Those are from very, very, very amazing um, members. And I want to make sure they get that love. So please, even if you're watching this replay and you see some links being dropped, actually, please hit those links. Thank you so much, everybody who's watching the replay. All right, so go over to Nana's house. She usually does live streams on Fridays. So she'll be probably trying to get them in. Uh, if She usually does 4.45 p.m. Eastern, but she may switch it up a little bit every so often if she has a little more time and there's a, a, a window open around 6 p.m. Eastern. She will try to get in there and have a little more time to share with us what she's working on. She makes really, really big, intricate projects. Let's see here. Let's keep going. Good morning, Jolene. Jolene is one of our amazing family members as well. Thank you so much, Jolene, for everything that you do. We appreciate you. We... uh. We have been making uh, a blanket, and uh, we called for a lot of people. Um, and this is a while ago. So this was planned a while ago. So we already had a certain amount of people to ask. And uh, we have been, you know, some people have been not able to do it. Some people have things come up. And so uh, my husband kind of took it upon himself and said, Hey, Jolene, can you, can you fill in for us? Can you help us out? And can you come to the rescue? And this young lady did. And I was like, wow, what an amazing woman. She stepped up for us. And uh, thank you so much for that, Jolene. Appreciate you so much. This young lady is amazing. She comes in with encouraging words. She supports, I, this lady not only supports this channel, but she supports my husband's channel too. And it's like, what? And, and many of you do. I'm not saying that. But I'm like, thank you, Jolene, for doing that. That's a true blessing. I love you so much. And we got Melissa in the building. Melissa crochets with love. Hey, Melissa. Melissa in the building. She says, hey, come on in here. How are you doing? Melissa is amazing, guys. She is on the Gold Squad as well. And her command is exclamation mark Melissa. So she's working on getting those numbers all the way up, up, up. And so let's go over and subscribe to her. If you do see her name in the chat, we'll drop her link, exclamation mark Melissa. So if you are blue, that means you can drop those commands. So um, if you are ever like wondering, what are people doing? And I say those commands, you can drop those exclamation marks and you can do the same exact thing. As long as you're blue, you can do it too. If you're blue, you can do. Okay. But anyways, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh my goodness all right so yes go grab melissa how are you doing today melissa thank you for being here ella come on in here ella how are you doing i'm not sure if you're still in the building but thank you and welcome in everyone please hit the thumbs up because we're going to get into our craft in a few minutes all right let's see who's all here and manda my beautiful sister manda's in the building representing gold squad if you don't have her please grab her her command is exclamation mark manda welcome in sis how you doing this young lady is super amazing, motivating, and inspiring. She's always been someone who's been in my life to keep me focused. <laughs> so keep on going. You got this. Just stay focused. And that's what I've been doing. Um, so, and it's just really been paying off. I've been working a lot, really, really hard, guys. So I got a lot of new things coming out. I can't wait to share with y'all what my whip is. I stayed up a bit working on it. Carl Joe has me working, so. <laughs> Carl Joe has me working. Oh, you know, I forgot. I forgot to grab my tape measure. Everything's downstairs. And. I'm going to be getting a space here, guys. You know that? I decided to get a space here for the basement area. And then I have to close up the, the vents. I thought it was a, a bright idea to have the vents open so that the cold, so the heat could come down to the basement. But now it's summertime and there's no heat on. <laughs> so now there's cold air coming out to the basement. So I'm going to have my son just go ahead and do what he'll do. And he'll close his babies up and uh, get them done. That's why they're closed in the first place. And then I'm going to just get a space here. Do you guys agree with that? you think that's a good idea? Because I want to do my crafts on there. I can't. I keep trying. Um, I, and like I said, I can still probably do craft hour up here. But like like my video, like everything, I need to stay downstairs. Like I cannot, I cannot stay organized up here. I can't keep the living room clean. I just, I try. I shouldn't say can't. This is a little difficult. I love to say that because I don't want to get into that can't mode. It's a little difficult because I have all my creative juices flowing. 
I want to have multiple whips up. And when I'm doing this, I can't do multiple whips. I like to have two or three whips going. It's a great thing. I know a lot of y'all have a lot of whips going on. Right now, I'm doing one thing at a time, and it's like I'm not getting anything done. So I need my I need to get those juices flowing. So I'm thinking about getting that heater. Um, and I look on Amazon. That's some pretty nice ones, but I'm just not sure. Uh, something like 20, what is it? Something like 29, 35, something there. And I just wasn't sure how they cover. Like, do I put it in front of me here? Do I put it on the side? Let it blow? I don't know if anybody's ever had any. How, how does the heat circulate? Is it just one concentrated area? Is it kind of like smooth? You know, so that's what I'm really wanting to get for the basement and then uh, get ready to get started and get my hunger on. And uh, let's see. Oh, look at my mom. Welcome in. Mama's in that building. Good morning. That's my mom, guys. If you, I hope you're still here, mom. I don't know if you are. But it's my mother. What? <laughs> Come on in, Ma. Thank you for coming in. That thumbs up. And uh, thank you for all your support, all your love. How you doing? I, you have been a little bit missing in action. Where, where have you been up to? My mom's getting ready to plan a trip to Florida. So she is getting ready for that next week, guys. So she's going to be on the on the uh, byways up in the air on the, on the plane, guys, traveling for about a week or so. So that's going to be a good time. And uh, thanks for being here, Mom. I'm not sure if you're still in the building or not. Uh, and if anybody's coming in now and I haven't got your comments, I'm coming. I'm really behind the comments because so I'm doing a lot of this here. And uh, and Stephanie's saying hello to Melissa. How you doing, sweet friend? And Nana Michelle saying, my morning was boring without you today, Linda. Yes. Oh, yes. So you, you'll get to see her after this, guys. We get to go to Linda's after this. So she's going to, I like having these afternoons with her. So I know y'all like y'all mornings with her, but I like the afternoons with her. I'm just going to be honest. Because y'all know I can't get up that early. I go to sleep at 4.30 in the morning. So I need Linda at 12 p.m. <laughs> I do. Um, because I, I and mean, then it feels really good, it does. And also, hold on, wait a minute. I am so sorry, but can we do this the right way? We need to do this the right way. I know I introduced Linda. I know I did. I know I talked about her channel. I know I said, oh, she's on the Platinum Squad. She has her own company. But can we give her a round of applause? Everybody in the chat, this young lady just reached 3K subscribers. <laughs> That is a right. Congratulations, Linda. You are amazing and you deserve it. I can see you just going up and up and up even more and more in the near future. I applaud you. Keep on going. All that hard work is paying off. This young lady does awesome videos and live streams and she's very consistent with her schedule. So if anybody's ever wanting to know how do you have a successful YouTube channel and why do people say consistency matters, check on this lady right here because it does. She's very, very consistent in what she does. She, I don't, I don't know her schedule. I have no idea what the things she does in behind the scenes on top of testing for everybody and being in so many different chats, staying up late nights, working on things that she wanted to make herself. This young lady sticks to a schedule. On Sunday nights, I'm going to have a video uploaded. First Tuesday of the month, you're going to see a giveaway. And she has these different days where she does her blog and she doesn't have a, do you have your blog up now or is it coming soon? Let us know so we can be a part of that. She's going to be having things for sale very shortly too. So you can be able to grab her goodies up. She, her work is very intricate. It's not going to be like just normal work. She puts so much love and thought into that work. So we get to actually see things that she has for sale. So I'm ready to purchase. I don't know about you guys, but I like to purchase goodies. So we'll go over to her house and her blog and be able to purchase some goodies from her. So again, thank you so much, Linda. Congratulations again. I'm sorry. Let me make sure I give you some love. And we're going to have a lot of milestones this month. I'm ready to celebrate with each and every one of y'all. Please, this is going to be a great month. This is going to be such a great month. I went to different people's channels. I said, wow, so many people are closed. I cannot believe how many people are close to these milestones and how many people are going to be getting there. This is off the chain. I'm super excited to celebrate. I am so excited. I could just dance right now for you guys. I know y'all are excited. And, uh, okay, well, StreamYard just jumped me all the way down. They said I was talking too long. I was talking too long, so let me... Um, <laughs> I got all the way down, all the way down. So they got me all the way at the bottom now. So let's just go to the bottom. <laughs> and uh, hey, welcome in, Whisper. Only had time to say hi. No worries. Have a great day. And thank you for coming in. And let's see. And Grojo saying, woohoo, Linda. Everybody's showing some love to Linda. That is what I'm talking about. I'm so happy. Look at Linda. She's so super excited. Hey, welcome in. Ms. Donna's in that building. She said, just visit Tampa, Florida. Wonderful city, friendly people in the small town feel. Had an amazing night. Really? Oh my goodness. How was it? Did, did you get a nice tan? Hey, Brenda Scrabbity Dude. I come on in here. This young lady is amazing as well. Hey, Brenda. Sorry I haven't been to your house. I have been super busy trying to get myself together. 
Uh, <laughs> trying to get myself. I have so much going on, but I can't wait to go to hang out with Brenda's. Uh, Brenda's really hardworking as well. So she has a big channel where she's doing a lot of people, helping people get to know each other. She does diamond painting. She does scrapping. And she is super, super sweet. So go over to her house. She usually does streams at nighttime, but she even have one in the afternoon where she's taking us on a journey with her, either a trip or some diamond painting with her. So go over to Brenda's house. I'm sorry, guys. I'm behind the chat and I went down and I'm back up. <laughs> and GGP. Hey, GGP. Welcome in. How you doing? Let's see. Let's see. Everybody's here. Mama said, I'm still here. Thank you, Mama, for still being here. How are you doing this morning? Please let me know. How are you feeling? Uh, are you drinking your coffee? Is everybody drinking coffee this morning? Let us know what you're all drinking this morning. Is it coffee? Is it tea? Is it pop like me? Oh, Sis Chandra going in. Sis Chandra's in the building. One of our amazing members. Sis Chandra, how are you doing today? I'm so glad that you're here. I'm so, so glad. Come on in and uh, let us know how are you doing today. Because I'm so happy to have you. So, so happy to have you in the building. And uh, let us know what you're up to. And this young lady is great at making dolls. I know some of y'all like your Emma Groomies. This young lady does great. And she has a business of making them. So if you have a doll, a baby girl in your family who would like a doll, you can please let her know and she'll make it for you. So I don't I, I don't mind making a doll, but I don't make dolls. Mm -mm. So uh, yeah, Sandra's a lady who you can get a great doll from, customized hairstyle. I mean, she makes the hair. She makes the face. I mean, I'm like, yeah, that's a lot of work. Yes. And she'll make a pretty dress if it's a girl, like... She does really, really great work. Y'all go check her channel out so y'all can see exactly what she has going on, okay? And also, Chandra, if you have other ways we can see some of your work, Facebook or anything, Instagram, let us know as well. So we can check out your beautiful work. There goes my husband, guys, at Joe's Bowling Sports and Ministry Talks TV. That's his channel, guys. His command is exclamation mark Joe. He's pastor, husband, son, father, <laughs> you name it, praise and worship leader, and his own channel as well. So y'all go check him out on his channel. He will be doing live streams usually Mondays, Tuesdays, and Wednesdays at 12 p.m. Eastern. Um, and so we get to go to his house and have some fun. And I cannot wait to see his next live stream. Last night, um, we had some praise and worship here on the Triple C and Joe show, which was a late night stream that we do as well, where we come together. Um, and it's a really good time. And it was so fun to just let him just let God use him. And he would just get on up in there and have some fun. And it was a blessing to have him do that. And I was able to get a little work done. At the same time, so it was a blessing as well. Uh, but grab with this young man and show him some sweet love because he is just a bee's knees, all right? <laughs> we love you so much, honey, and I thank you so much for being here. How are you doing this morning? Tell me something good. I hope you're feeling good, and I love you. Um, and good morning to you. Let me see if I missed anybody. Jen Reeves, come on in. Jen Reeves, long time. No see, and I'm glad you're here with me. And thank you for hitting that thumbs up. I hope you're working on something beautiful and uh while you're listening and working on a pattern. I can't wait to see what it is. I hope you all are enjoying my craft hour as well as my crochet group. Everyone is invited. If you do have a chance to uh, check out my, um, let me see, what was I going to say? Check out my crochet group. It's called Creatively Created Crocheters. Also check out my website because if you do check out the website, there's a birthday club. There's a subscribing club. So you can join the birthday club, put your birthday in that baby. You'll get a uh, coupon. And also, don't forget, you can join the coupon the birthday club, but you can join the subscribing club too, because I'm going to have something new coming out for those who subscribe. I'm going to create a pattern just for you. And so when you do subscribe, guess what's going to happen? You're going to get a free pattern. And also, Granny says, thanks for the shout outs. Love you too. Did you see the Linda one, the Mossage? Wow. Congratulations. I know you said the video's up, Granny. I didn't get a chance to look. I slept all day yesterday, woke up super late, and then um, I started working on all the channels and I'm just working. You know, that's what I do when I, as soon as I woke up, I was like, it's work time. I need, I need to get this stuff together. <laughs> so congratulations, Linda, on winning. Wow, Linda. Now pay yourself $10, okay? Don't. If you put it aside for yourself. <laughs> congratulations, Linda. And uh, it's a blessing. You deserve it. So me and Joe got to send you some cash. <laughs> we love you, Linda. How are you doing today? Congratulations. This young lady is amazing. It's so fun when our family wins, isn't it? And is that IBB? Come on in here. IBB is one of our amazing Gold Squad members. Y'all grab with this young lady. This young lady's work is amazing. I can check her out here. I can check her on Instagram. Please, please, please. Her command is exclamation mark IBB. That's I V Y B. That's exclamation mark I V Y B. Please come go to subscribe to her channel. Let's see what kind of number she has going on because I'm telling you. Telling you, telling you, telling you. Oh my gosh. You are going to be loving what she's doing over there. How are you doing, IBB? 
I said, this, and she's always testing people's patterns or working on something new. And I was like, I need to get this young lady when she's free. I need you, Ivy B. I need you. <laughs> I need you because your work is amazing, and uh, I need some help with some testing. I, I got. I'm trying to build an elite squad of testers. I have already an elite squad already, but I want to get more. <laughs> because I need to get more patterns. I, I want to have at least three patterns going out at once. So that's just where I want to go. Is that Ruby? Hello. Welcome in, Ruby. Come on in here. How are you doing? Ruby's in that building. Ruby, you want a membership giveaway? So please shoot me an email so you can pick a free pattern on my Etsy or my Rowry, okay? So please shoot me an email. I want you to get your free pattern, okay? How are you doing, Ruby? We're, Ruby's one of our amazing members. And it's such a blessing for people to join the membership because you don't have to have a YouTube channel. You don't have to do any of that. You just have to push the join button next to the subscribe button or go in the description and hit the Patreon link. And then you can join that way too. There's two different memberships. All right. Patreon is one that's not going to take as many fees, but it will not give you a badge. You will turn blue. Yes, you will too. But you will not um, get a badge next to your name or get custom emojis. Now, if you join on YouTube, it will take a hefty amount of fees out. I won't get the full amount, but you will get a badge next to your name and you'll be able to use custom emojis. So, if you do want to join, it will take a monthly fee out of your accounts every single month, regularly, and then uh, it will be a, it will be basically being a blessing to this channel. But if you look at each perk when each membership team, you will notice that there it will be. Um, you'll notice um, that you'll you'll put those in, but you'll notice that there's different levels, there's different perks for every level. Okay, we got Katrina in the building. Katrina's on that blood news squad. If you don't have her, please grab her up today. She'll be live at about 2 p.m. Eastern. I believe today. I'm trying to get Katrina's schedule down law. I'm trying. Uh, she did release a new video today, guys. So we got, I mean, we got new videos. Uh, that was yesterday. So we got new videos from Katrina, a live stream for Katrina today. Um, and so she'll be having some stuff she's working on, finishing up. Like she's just really good at doing that. I like her wearables. I'm all, I always stress it a lot. I love her wearables. Her command is exclamation mark K world. All right. So we can check out what she's got going on today. And let's have some fun over Katrina's way. And uh, thank you for being here, Katrina. I appreciate the love and the support. I'm um, just grabbing these young ladies. Seriously, um, mother, wife, extraordinary. So y'all grab her up and uh, enjoy what she's doing. All right, Oreo, come on in here. Oreo, how you doing, Oreo? <laughs> Oreo's a cheese lover like me. Uh, I'm, always, I'm just always trying to get Oreo to expand with different type of cheeses. Not only your your mozzarella or your cheddars or the sharp cheddars. I'm trying to get Oreo to go into the Swiss, the Gutierrez. I think she might have tried Swiss. Swiss already, but some Gutier, maybe a smoked Gouda, mm, maybe even a blue, um, maybe a monster. But anyways, Oreo loves her cheese. She's amazing. She's got a green thumb. She's been planting some goodies over there. So shout out to you, Oreo. She loves the color. Oh my goodness. Oreo loves the color, guys. Yes, she does. She's amazing. So shout out to you, Oreo. How are you doing this morning? Thank y'all for being here. Oh my goodness, Sashandra. I'm good. I'm doing good, Sashandra. I'm just happy to be here, and I'm, I appreciate you for being here. I really, really do. All right, let's see here. And I believe really said, Shonda, you want to get away? Well, didn't you? I want to make sure I got all the members down. I want to make sure everybody gets their love. I think everybody is good. I think I just got like maybe, maybe one or two people to people I'm working on. I know we had Kim who won. Yeah, I think she said, Shonda did too. So we want to make sure everybody is taken care of for this month. Um. Oh my goodness, second cup of tea today? Mmm. What kind of teas do you drink, Nana Michelle? Are you a black tea, green tea? What kind of teas are we drinking here? I have to try black tea. Everybody said black tea is good and it pumps you up. Like it gets you going. And that's what I want. I'm always drinking green tea. I'm like, I don't know if it's good for me or not. And my mom said she got a second cup going. Oh my god, mama got the second cup going. All right, mom. I'm glad you got the second cup going. My mom um is really good at making coffee. I remember I think we I've learned how to make coffee or how to drink it, how I liked it. <laughs> By going to hospitals, not saying that it's good to go to hospitals, but in our life, we've had a lot of people being sick, a lot of people, you know, so we've had a lot of waiting room stays. So we'd be in the waiting room and they put us in the room with the coffee, of course. <laughs> so I'm like, okay, I'm going to make coffee. And I didn't like, I never, you see, you don't know what you like until somebody makes it good and then you're like, oh, I like it. You know, because you can go to somebody's house and they can make something and it's just all wrong. And then you're like, oh, I don't like that. So you banish every single thing in that category. So somebody, you go to somebody's house and they make, cabbage and they make it all wrong and you're like i don't like cabbage you know you're like oh you really don't know i just don't like it but if you get somebody to make it the right way it's like oh i like it i like it a lot so mama's one of those people who made coffee and she can make a mean cup of coffee so she just made it up for me and she's like oh you want to make it or you want to make it i was like you can make it 
And uh, I remember her, the first time I turned that cup of coffee, it was like a perfect blend of sugar, perfect blend of cream, and it was just ding. And so that's how I knew how I liked my coffee. Starting off at a young age. Um, when I was young, I could drink it. Um, I started drinking with my grandmother at a young age. Um, we had some instant coffee, and I would drink it. But I don't remember a lot of cream. I don't remember cream as a kid. I remember just drinking that coffee with sugar, and that was it. And then I got older. My mom introduced me to that cream, and I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> it was like, okay. So coffee for Donna as well. All right, Donna, I got that coffee. Oh, my gosh, y'all. This is a blessing to be here. Hey, this is Marsha Lee in that building. Come on in. Come on in. You're working on your uh, 20 mini gray squares. Ooh, for a baby dress. Okay. Pray for me as I get it done. Yeah, I will definitely pray for you because when it comes to granny squares, Mm -hmm. I was actually gifted an Afghan made of squares. So the squares are almost done. I think all, there's a lot of squares. I don't know who's going to put those together. I just don't know. Mm -mm. Nope. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Hey, Butterfly Jen, come on in here. Butterfly Jen, welcome in. One of our amazing members. If you don't have her, please grab her up. Good morning to you. How are you feeling? Hey, Elaine. Elaine's hooked on your yarn. Lord, Lord. Elaine's hooked on yarn and life. She said, I miss my mom's Puerto Rican coffee. Oh, my goodness. Really? Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. I would love to try that. Is it like a stronger coffee? Is it a stronger blend? I love stronger blends. I'm going to be honest. Crojo says, I'm drinking black tea now, but I still love my coffee. And I'm like, yeah, I, see? So, which one wakes you up more, Crojo? Let's be honest. Let's break this out of here. Which one wakes you up more? Would it be the coffee or the tea? What can, like, if you like really like had a, <laughs> you need to wake yourself up, which, what are you grabbing? What are you really, and you need to wake up? Are you grabbing that tea or are you grabbing a coffee? Let's just be real. Let's be real, guys. <laughs> Let's be real. Because I need to make sure I don't make a wrong move one morning. I'm like, hey, guys, I got tea. I'm still half sleep. Guys, I got tea. <laughs> Let me know which one I should grab because I don't want to grab them. <laughs> hey, Pivy does it all. Welcome in. Pivy's on our amazing Platinum Squad. Come on in, Ezra. If you don't have this young man, go to his channel. Guess what's been happening? Oh, my gosh. He's been grinding. Live stream, live stream, live stream, live stream. All right, so shout out to you, Ezra. What's going on with you? You said, I love some cinnamon black tea. Now, I've never had those cinnamon black teas. I love cinnamon, and I don't mind a bit of tea, but I've never tried all of it together. <laughs> I never have. So I'm excited to see what's going on. Uh, Pivy's ready to hit that 200, over 200 mark. So Pivy's over at 155. So let's get Pivy up to those numbers. We're ready to celebrate, y'all. We're ready to celebrate. Okay, and HD's in the morning. Come on in, HD. Y'all hit those thumbs up as y'all come in. Hope you're having a beautiful morning. Learning while you're lurking while you're doing some. Oh my goodness, you're doing some virtual learning. Yeah, let me see what everybody else is saying in the chat. I don't want to want to miss anybody. Coffee wakes me. Oh, okay, okay. Thank you, Krojo. Okay, I gotta ask Krojo. I gotta ask because you know you, we always want to know. Inqu inquiring minds want to know which one will do the trick. Now, of course, we don't want to say. We don't, we're going to kick tea out. But there's some times where we need to wake up. We need to pick me up. And so we got to get something to get us pick up. It depends on what we like. You know what I mean? I like to be amped up. Now, it depends on if I want to be more chill, calm, relaxed, sure. But if I'm trying to get woken up and do a back a, a backflip, I have to get some coffee. I must do it. And Linda says, lemon and ginger tea is my favorite drink of the day. What? Oh, my goodness. So that's what I, maybe I have to try some lemon and ginger tea. I'm not sure if my first drink, Linda, but I got to try it at least. Um, you know, I got to try it at least. But I get all these tea. Well, see, are y'all loose leaf drinkers or are y'all the tea bag drinkers? Because I've been I've been talking to some diehard tea drinkers, and they told me, don't mess with those bags. They said, get the loose leaf. I said, loose leaf. I did not know loose leaf. Guys, I just knew tea bags, guys. I didn't know. I'm buying these virtual, virtual. I'm buying these value boxes of tea bags, okay? Uh, I have like a berry tea in there. My granny said, get some berry tea. You like your fruity? So I said, yeah, I do. I'm a fruity. So I grabbed my fruity tea. I grabbed a box of that. And uh, I think I have like a berry tea in there. Uh, maybe a lemon and honey tea. Um, and some other tea. But they're all green. Okay. And they're all uh, in there. I don't even. They could be expired for all I know. I, I got them maybe a year ago. I don't know, guys. I thought I was going to be a tea head. I don't know. I was going to have tea parties. Well, let's keep going. Let's just keep going. <laughs> let's keep going. My mom says 100% folders. Colombian. Oh, that Colombian coffee. Well, I got to admit, that Colombian coffee will do the trick. I remember me and my husband, we were coming home from a college campus meeting from our, for our daughter. Speaking of that, today is orientation day. That's right, guys. So me and, our daughter, me and my daughter will be sitting here on the couch looking at the advisors and everybody talking about the school time. It's four hours long. 
I'm bringing the crafty project along with me in a notebook to take every bit of notes so I can keep all the stuff in my hand. Um, and yeah, that's what we're going to be doing. But my, we were coming home from the college trip one day, right? And Joe was kind of like getting a little tired and he's the only one that's going to be driving. So he's on the road. He's like, honey, I'm a little, I don't know what's going on. I said, oh no. <laughs> but he, he wasn't like that. It wasn't like he was going to fall asleep at the wheel. That's He's a very trustful driver. Very. And we don't get in the highways. We get on the back roads, okay? So that's really a good thing. It's a true blessing. But um, he was like, hey, it's a little, little, you know, a little rest. You know, when you're on the passenger side, you can get a little wink in. But when you're on that on the driver's seat, no winks for you. So I said, oh, okay, go into the gas station. First thing I see was a bit of Colombian. And, you know, you never know how the gas stations can make them right. I went to one gas station, and it was no coffee. They made the coffee, but there was nothing in it. I looked at it. It was clear. I said, Lord, she forgot to put the filter in. Help me, Lord. <laughs> but I went in, I checked the coffee, I tasted it. One taste. A few seconds later, I woke up. I said, oh, they make a mean Colombian. So I said, okay, this is going to be too strong. I made a large cup. So I tried to put like mostly all Colombian and I added a little regular on top. And then I put a sugar and cream in. My husband was like, babe, what did you put in? <laughs> he said, honey, what was this? What's this? And I said, it's Colombian, honey. It's, you got what you said, you need to wake up. Oh my gosh, we woke up. We were all the way up, all the way up, guys. Well, we did crash, but it, it got the job done. Uh, Colombian is the way to go. Try it, try it, try it, guys. I'm telling you, I might grab some today. Just, just in case of the nighttime when we do our, our triple C and Joe's, I'm going to a little something. I'm going <laughs> to, oh my goodness. Tangs for you? Is that a brand? Tangs? Oh my goodness. Hey, Meg, come on in here. Meg's in that building. Our amazing Gold Squad member. If you don't have her, go grab her up. Um, she was doing some great things on her on sewing some goodies, guys. Sewing beautiful pieces. I was had the uh, opportunity to be able to purchase a beautiful scrunchie from this young lady, and it's made of some silky fabrics. Beautiful, beautiful. Uh, and like I said, when I get into my craft room, guys, I will be able to share every single thing from every one of my members that I have. If I don't have anything from my members, I'll be able to uh, get something and then share it. That's my goal. But I can't bring everything here in the living room because there will just be no. Literally, there will be no way to get that <laughs> and it'll be just too hard to handle so that's why i want to get to my craft room because i'll have stuff hanging up behind me boop, boop, boop. and i can just pull it down as we go and then y'all can see it you know so y'all can know exactly who's responsible for what how are you doing meg go grab her up on her etsy she'll probably drop her etsy i hope she does minister music's in the building come on in here minister music how are you y'all come on in and hit the thumbs up and welcome in to craft hour triple c this young man is amazing he'll be doing a stream tonight which is going to be off the chain we're going to go to there where it's going to be a praise and worship Someone's going to deliver some praise and worship, and someone's going to deliver a word. It's going to be 8 p.m. Eastern tonight. I'm excited. I love to go there. When I go there, I feel like family. And guess what else, guys? Hold on. Wait a minute. Guess whose birthday is going to be tomorrow? This young man right here. Now, I know he's a member at different people's houses, right? I know he is. So if you can go bless this young man on his cash app, okay, and show him some sweet love tomorrow, it is his birthday. I don't know if he's going to have a birthday party or what. I don't know if he's going to just keep it quiet, but it's his birthday tomorrow, guys. So let's go be a blessing to him. Um, even when he does, he does a stream after this, uh, 11 a.m. Eastern. Um, if you guys want to go over there and just listen to some praise and worship and be a blessing and send him a super chat or something like that, wish him a happy birthday. He's raising four amazing children, two bro two boys, two girls, and, uh, two graduates back to back. Last year, his baby girl graduated his oldest. I don't, I don't say baby girl because oh, it's called our girls, baby girls, even though they're grown, <laughs> but she just graduated last year. And in this year, his, his namesake, TJ. Graduate this year as well. So shout out to your amazing, beautiful baby girl, Sierra, and your awesome husband, your awesome son, TJ. All right. And then we have two little ones, Jeremiah, as well as um help me, help me, help me. I was doing good. I had her name in my head. Help me, Lord. Um, she just had her birthday as well. So we want to show some love to oh my gosh. Sorry, Miss Music. Your baby girl as well, your little one. Uh she just had her birthday. So Terrence, Mr. Music took her out on a beautiful beautiful trip every time they have birthdays or holidays he like goes all the way out for them and i like that i'm like kudos so y'all go to his house and show him some love and again like i said tomorrow's his big day so we can see him i don't know how old he's gonna be guys i don't know if he's gonna share <laughs> um he'll be next tomorrow is his day so we want to celebrate mr music's birthday guys okay and uh you said i suck at making my uh at fruity teas i always make them too watery really i don't know i just use a bag guys i don't know anything about the teas guys he said, my favorite tea is apple cinnamon and peppermint. Loose in bags. I love the loose. I'm drinking loose in tea now. I see chamomile or peppermint. Ooh, a night to relax. Ooh. Loose sleep sometimes they seep tea. Oh, they seep tea off the floor of the factory. 
What? Really? Oh my God. Look at private and toes walking. So you get these little loose leaves. They ain't put in the bag. It's like, oh, I got to drop a couple of these loose. Let me sweep some of this up. So you just have a little bit of that floor gravel. So we think if we're getting excited and getting woke up from the caffeine and this tea, all along we're getting woken up and getting uh, our rush from the floor dirt. Is that, what you're, is that what you're saying? Sis Nazia, come on in. How you been feeling? I'm so happy that you're here. Welcome in. Come on in. Come on in. All right. So we can do Tiana. Thank you, Mr. Me. Tiana. Yes. Our, Mr. Me, we got we have Tierra, TJ, we have Jeremiah, and we have Tiana. So I wonder where Jeremiah comes from because Jeremiah, this is the only T name. No T name for Jeremiah. And hello, Helen J. Come on in. We love you. How are you this morning? So happy to have you here. How are, what you working on, Helen J? Tell us more. I know you're working on something crazy. I know you are. For me, I'm working on a new top. And so I tried to bug my husband and get him on get on his nerves a bit. But he was he was tired last night. Hubby might be coming out with a small cold. We're not gonna claim it. But that's what he told me. He said, oh, yeah, just, might be a might be a little summer go. And that's when he gets them. He won't get them at all. But every so often he'll get a little something in the summer. I used to always get them in the summer too. But he's like, they don't little stuffy. I don't know what's going on. I don't know. He needs been in and out of different climates. Now, uh, running back and forth, taking our daughter to work, doing errands, help out the family from one hot area to one cold area. So, um, I know he's been dealing with that. So, we got to just keep lift up in prayer. Please keep my husband up in prayer. Um, he's like, honey, thanks for letting me get my rest. I'm like, get your rest, get whatever you need. Like, I'm, I'm a big fan of resting. Um, I'm a big fan of, <laughs> did I say that? I am I'm a big fan of resting and, and letting mm -hmm. you get your rest because I know how important it is. And uh, I used to be like, oh, well, you know, and even whatever time it is, like, whatever time it is, if the rest needs to be, if time of rest needs to happen, I'm going to get it. So that's what I do. He said, is this gallbladder? Oh, it's a gallbladder. Well, if anybody in their building has any doctor backgrounds, or even if you just have a slicing background, got any sharp utensil, please, I would love for you to come here and begin to do a surgical procedure for this gentleman. We got to get him into the surgery room. We got to get him in here under the knife and let's do this. I don't know what we're waiting for, but we got to get it done. I don't think we're really waiting on anything. But um, we just, maybe after his graduation, let's just do it. And let's go ahead and get it get it on, get it on done. A lot of people that have it done uh, are happy to get it out, you know. So let's just go get it done. It's been, like I said, it's infected. And, I mean, it's affected eating, sleeping patterns, and, you know, day-to-day -day living. So it's just time to get it out. Let's see. Let's see what Linda says. I started my first knit shop. Linda, you started them? Oh, I can't wait to come to your house today. I'm so ready. Linda, I'm so ready. I, I got to start mine too. But everybody keeps making me do other things. I'm just kidding. I'm just, I'm really kidding. I love y'all. But yeah, Crojo has me making a new top. And um, Linda told me how to put it together. So I'm doing a bottom of the top now. And I'm not going to tell you exactly what kind of top it's going to be. Um, but I'll share with you a little sneak peek of it. Okay. I'll share with you a little sneak peek. And that is going to be the bottom because I'm doing the top is going to be, what is the top going to be on? The top is going to be white and I'm going to do a baby blue and the yarn is all the way over there, wouldn't it be? But I'm trying, like I said, I'm trying to get a little bit organized so I don't have it on the floor at all. And I have it in the bag. What? Can y'all believe it? So yeah. And I was having to look at some of my patterns and I said, oh, I have some tote bag patterns that I have to release. And uh, I was looking at my knickknack patty whack tote. Guys, if you haven't made that up, you do have the pattern, please make up the knickknack patty whack tote. It's really spacious. Oh my gosh. It's really nice. Very nice size for y'all to put your um whips in, guys. Okay. I cannot wait to see in the socks either. I'm really excited. And that's gonna be today in my, a little bit over, a little bit less than two hours. All right. A little bit less than two hours. We can go and see Linda's socks. Because um, and maybe if you have a pattern or anything, you can share um and let us know what you're using. Because I have all my goodies for sock making. I have the yarn, I have the needles. And Helen J, Helen J, you recommended a yarn that's heavenly. You recommended a yarn that I promise they better not. Uh, they better not. Hold on. Let me grab it. They better not um, discontinue this yarn. This yarn is amazing. I would recommend this to anybody that's here. It is called Burnett Softy Cotton. Some of y'all already know this yarn. But me, I, I, you know what I mean, guys. I get, I hear about yarn when it's discontinued. 
So that's why I'm so like excited about it because I always hear about yarn um, when it's discontinued. Um, you guys are such a blessing to me that when y'all send me yarn, I try to use it as much as possible um, to create something because you guys are the best and I want to make sure I'm a great, show my gratefulness. So when I ever go get, get to go yarn shopping and uh, or whatever else, it's like, oh my gosh, this is crazy. So this yarn on the back, oh, I ended up using a Kieran cake, but it's, I, like I said, I just used it for, I used it um, for, I didn't even show it in the morning. I thought, I was wondering if I showed it in the morning stream, guys, I'm sorry. I'll show it in the morning um, before we get started in this craft. I'll show, I'll show it in the morning because I have nobody down here to help me out. Um, but I ended up using Kieran cake in the color mauve, but it, it's okay. It's just not the yarn that I will keep for that bag, but I will release that pattern out um, for everybody to have. But um, and it's just, it could be better to me. Um, but the yarn is not that bad. It's the color. I don't like the color. That's all. Um, but other than that, that's what I use. But this Baronet Softy Cotton, if anybody's ever used it. Hey, Amy, good morning. This right here, Helen J. Say, DJ, Helen J. It gives me Kobu vibes, even though it is 60% of cotton, 60% cotton and 40% acrylic. This yarn right here, it reminds me of like a Kobu. It, there's not a bit of bamboo in it, but the perfect blend of uh, acrylic and cotton. Burnett, you are on a roll with this. Like, I feel like I need to get like every single color. Like, that's why my birthday's coming up. And I promise, I hope they don't have this discontinued. Because this right here is perfect. 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 It has a beautiful drape to it. I can see myself making shawls with this. Now, if y'all want to make something like this, grab it up. Now, it might not be for every project, okay? Because some stuff doesn't need drape. Some stuff we need to have a little bit of, you know, some stuff we need to be a little bit more sturdy. I wouldn't say do a bag or something with this. Unless I do some bags you could do. I could do my pineapple bag with this, couldn't I? Because it is cotton. And if you line it, you're good. All you have to do is line it. I think my I think my pineapple bag would be great. So we'll see. But um but guys, this yarn is really, really sweet. It reminds me of a bamboo cotton blend. And it's there's no bamboo in it. And the way they wove it, it wasn't it's not a tight wove, it's kind of a, you know, a tight spin. It's kind of like a it's it's nice. Very, very nice. Um I had a couple split uh split things, a couple instances of splitting, but other than that. Um, nothing bad. It, it wasn't a, nothing I know I can't handle. Uh, but you guys are going to love this when I'm going to come up with this. I'm excited to bring it to you guys. Very, very, very excited. My first time ever making anything like this. So, and the juices just came in overnight and I woke up. I'm like, babe, babe. He's like, huh? Mm -hmm. I was like, honey, I was like, honey, do you like it? It was good. He's like, I was like, okay. And then I said, honey, honey, I have another idea. Should I do this with it or should I do this with it? He was like, I don't know, man. So I don't know. I'm still gonna ask him again now that he's woke, or if he's not woke, but in a minute I'll ask him again before because this is gonna take off. I'm gonna measure it, and this is gonna take off. We're gonna try to get, shoot for this baby to get done real soon. Um, and again, I will be having the bag pattern out for you guys. I'll try to get it modeled by my mannequin or outdoor somewhere so I can put um, I put the mannequin out there. I mean, I put the bag out for you guys to get. Um, and for those who didn't get it yet, uh, I'll have it out for you guys. And uh, thank you for everybody for purchasing my new pattern. My uh, pineapple pattern is called Tropical Twist. Again, if you purchase on the website, you use code Tropical, you get a dollar off. Now, you can still purchase on Etsy and Ravelry, but there's no sale on that one. It's on my website only. And uh, thank you all for grabbing that up. I appreciate y'all for inviting my heart. I got a, I got a compliment on your lighting airy poncho of yours that I was wearing yesterday. The lady wasn't there. Oh, wow. Did you, did you get any orders? Or do you do orders, Crow Joe? Because that's when you pull out the business cards and say, I only charge this for it if you want to order that. Send me the, you know what I'm saying? Crojo. Crojo. <laughs> there you go. That's some more pocket change for you. Crojo, that's some more pocket change for you. That's Now you made a poncho. Now you can flip it. Boop. And now you can buy more yarn for yourself. You know, this, that's that's some, just a thought. <laughs> that's just a small thought. Just, you know, hey, go sell those packs. Go get that stuff out of here. Go sell those uh, makes up and get some of those goodies made up. Of course, we have free time. And he said, I hope they don't either. I love good yarns. I know. Say it again, Mick. We love, we get addicted to these delicious yarns. And like the thing is, I've been using Lion Brand. I've been using, what have I been using, guys? Lion Brands, Red Hearts. I can't think. <laughs> Premier. I've been using different yarns, right? But Burnett, the only yarn I used to use from Burnett was basically like a value yarn. Kind of like, you know, we all, every brand has a value yarn. 
So that way we'll be able to, um, you know, get some value goods in, be able to have some stuff to stock our um, stashes up to make, you know, basic stuff, basic blankets, basic things that we just want to test out. Uh, but I never went through Burnett's. I never went to Burnett's whole line to see what all they have. And this right here, this right here, I have to get more. I You can even, you know what I'm going to even play around with? Adding a bit of some, uh, a little shimmer. You can even pair this with a bit of a sparkle to do the trick. And that's what I think I'm going to do with my bag. I'm going to find a different color, and I'm going to pair it with a bit of a sheen. I mean, a, a shimmer, a crochet thread, a crochet yarn, um, a glitter yarn. Pair with that. Well, not this color per se, but find all the colors they have. Pair with a bit of a glitter, glitter yarn, and I'm going to make the bag again. And I'm going to make it with this and a thin strand of some uh, glitter yarn. And we're going to take it to another level. So we'll see that again. We're going to see uh, how you can. I'm going to share two different ways of making this bag. How you can dress it up or dress it down. So that's what's going to be on that. I need to write that down because I'll I forget that. But like, then did you ever do that? I'm like, no. Because I went out of one ear and went out the other. I have to write it down. And we're about to get into this craft. So forgive me for taking all your time up. And thank God for being here. If we, I wasn't able to be here yesterday because we had a carpet clean. We were supposed to be getting carpet replacement. We got a carpet cleaning um, instead. And uh, so I wasn't able to be here yesterday because um, so we had to get all that taken care of. And uh, so I wasn't able to be here. And I had an appointment on top of it. And the appointment lasted way longer than I thought. So I'm so glad I did cancel because I was thinking, like, oh, I'll be here. That point lasted a long time long. So, and it was just a phone. It was a phone. Um, a phone and uh, appointment. Okay, let's see what I'm gonna do, guys. Add glitter yarn. Okay, just burn that softy for tropical twist bag. Okay. And if any of you want to get some of those type of glitter yarns, you can go over to yarnnuts.com. Okay, and that's Gia. She has plenty of delicious um, gold or different kind of shades of glitter yarns to match every shade you want. So you can have the same shade and make it pop, or you can do just a complete opposite shade. Like you can add silver in there if you want. You can have whatever you want, and it'll make something uh, a little less glamorous to another level. Okay. Thank you so much, Helen J. Thank you. Oh my gosh, Pride Planners will be available today in about one hour on Amazon. So please, this is the website and it'll take you to the Amazon where you guys can grab all kinds of planners. Please, please go grab your planners, guys, and check them out. I want you guys to please be, to be a part of what you got going on. And uh, what Crozier, she's killing the game with these planners, guys. She's killing the game, and I want you guys to be able to take part in that. So we're going to get into our craft for today. Got my tripod handy. And uh, let's get into the craft. Is anybody working on anything this morning? Let me know if you're working on anything. I'll probably be working on this top, guys. See how far I get along with it. And then after I do that, I'm going to be working on... Um, what am I going to work on, guys? I'm going to work on this top. But I'm also going to be working on uh, doing an orientation with my daughter as well. So... Me and my sister, we hung out late last night, and I had a ball with her. I'm going to admit, she got me up last night, and I was working, so it was fun. We got to work and talk. I said, you know what? Oh, Katrina working on summer top. Oh, working on getting my sight. Then another pop. Oh, okay. That's what I'm talking about. I'm working on a pair of slippers. Wow, Miss Geraldine, I love it. Finishing this rainbow hat and stealing, and dealing with yarn bar. Oh, well, I wish you all the luck with that yarn bar. My beautiful, my handsome, amazing Pivey. <laughs> I, I, my thing is, I'm, I'm working on that. When it comes to yarn bark, I'm very quick to snip. <laughs> very quick to snip when it comes to yarn bark. I, I, I'm going to be honest. I don't like you. I know, no, 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 make goose of yarn bark. No, no, no. I don't like yarn bark, guys. It's, it's a bit stressful. And you know, you have those creative juices flowing. Next thing you know, you got all kinds of yarn bark going on. And then your, your, your ideas might have went out the window because you got this brown bar to deal with. So I just snip it. My granny had a song. It's called Clipping Time. Okay, so that means clipping time. 
That means one eight. I like the fact. I like your um, thumbnail too. I like your new thumbnail, Pivey as well. Do you have a new banner as well? Let me see it. Okay, so Pivey, you gotta get your thumb uh, banner. I love that thumbnail. Okay, so let me see here. Um, where am I going? Oh, I'm going to my channel. I do have some a few tutorials up, guys. They're about thirty or something like that. Thirty some tutorials. Um, if you guys want ever want to check out my tutorials, I do have some. Say we're going to visit the tutorial archive. All right, we're going to go visit my tutorial archive. Uh, I'm going to go to my playlist, and then I'm going to go look for what I would call tutorials. <laughs> Let me go find them. Where are you, tutorials? Where are you? Tutorials, tutorials, tutorials. There you go. I got to go find my tutorial, guys. If I can find them. Where is it at? Tutorials. Mm, let's see. Tutorials, tutorials. Where are you? I can't find my tutorial, guys. Oh my gosh, help me out. Sorry, guys. Oh my goodness. Alright, I got my tutorial, guys. Okay, here we go. What size look am I using? Mm. I don't know what size is that. Is that four millimeter? That's like a four millimeter. Okay. And, okay. They're going to dirty something views on that video, okay? Right, that means I need to do some more tutorials, right? <laughs> okay, so I need to do some more tutorials. Alright, so let's see what everybody's saying in the chat. Is that can any of you help my children with school? Can I pay my children's school? Feed them up. Oh wow, I'm so sorry to hear that. Is this nausea? Wow. Then you said I can't believe you still remember. Yes, I remember that. Randy D, I remember that. I remember that clip in time. I gotta remember that. Hey, sis Jeannie's in the building. On that titanium what? Welcome in, sis Jeannie. What's up? How you doing this morning? If you don't have a young lady, please grab her up and show her some love. Her command is dreams with a Z. So we want to show her some love. Every Tuesday, she goes live at um, 8 p.m. Eastern, 7 p.m. Central. And she does a lot of beautiful live stream, a lot of beautiful videos, too. Yeah, that's right. She's even going to have some more patterns. She has a pattern on Ravel right now. And she's going to have more coming for us. How you doing, Sir Jeannie? Okay, you're working on Brenda's new test pattern. Wow, that's amazing. Mm -hmm. She just got monetized. She's still being able to be a blessing to other people's channels as well, which is truly, truly a lot of work. We're talking about mothering, grandmothering, wifing, daughtering. Oh, my gosh. She's doing it all. Sistering, helping people with their channels, testing patterns, doing her own patterns, making her own merch. Like, is she? The list goes on and on. Shout out to you. I don't know how you do it. <laughs> and I'm not sure. Jamie, you in the building? Jamie, are you still in the building? So, Jamie, in, are you in from the ads? Welcome in, Jamie. You did win the members uh, members wheel this month, last month, this month. <laughs> so, that means your channel will be going to your next level. That means you'll be celebrating 700 subscribers this month. Whoop, whoop. Go, Jamie. <laughs> Thanks for being one of my amazing members. I appreciate you. Thank you for trusting me with your channel. And thank you for loving my channel enough to be a member. Uh, so, I'm so ready for you to be at 700. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Congratulations to you. Um, hello, Kim is in the building. Kim and Lord, we'll be over at her house in a, about 30 minutes for some crafting. I'm going to get myself into the screen so we can talk some more, but y'all can see my hands instead. Okay, so let's do it. Let's do it. Kim, we love you, Kim. Kim's representing Kim's Crochet and Knits. And uh, her channel is, her command is exclamation mark Kim. She's on that gold, gold, double gold, dipping. she's double dipping gold. And so uh, we're going to go to her house. And show her some love because guess what's gonna happen? She'll be doing Whip Wednesday, okay? And we get to go to her house. I'm so happy. So Kim won the membership with as well. So she's about to be hitting 2K. Ah! <laughs> Congratulations, Kim! All the members that have been just like, doo, 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 doo. 
Like, y'all remember this moment. Uh, it's going to be so many milestones. What are we going to do with all these milestones? We got 2Ks, 3Ks, 4Ks, 5Ks. I'm going insane. I don't know what to say right now. I'm super duper excited. Like, I don't even know what to do. So many members, y'all are just y'all are just doing our thing. Shout out to every member, guys. I'm so happy for y'all. So happy. Yes, yes, yes. And I'm so happy that you're here, Sis Jeannie. So many people have been saying, where's my Sis Jeannie at? I'm going to get an email. I said, Lord. Sis Jeannie's okay, Lord. But they said, they want to see her. They said, Jeannie. So I'm glad that you see. There she goes, guys. Now, y'all give her some hugs and kisses while she's here, Lord. She's a very busy woman. Y'all give her hugs and kisses while she's here. And just chastity has been being creative. And we will have new items to show next Tuesday. What? So next Tuesday, guys, we'll be having some new pieces and merch. So keep those pocketbooks handy because we'll be able to go and shop at Sis Jeannie's house at Butterfly Dreams. Crochet with Jeannie. Okay? Yes, I know we miss our Sis Jeannie. But there she goes. She's here. She's here, y'all. Okay? All right. And let me see. What I'm going to do now is drop my link so I can get in this channel. It's just time. It's time for me to get myself up in here so we can get our craft on before we go over to Kim Law's house. Okay? All right. Now I got to get myself. Everyone's boxes want to be mailed out tomorrow. Granny D and Susanna, you both get a box from Chassis. Someone next week. Oh, my gosh. Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, my goodness. Thank you so much for that love. Take your time whenever you send it out. I, I, I'm just really... Whenever, so Jeannie, like I'm really that person. <laughs> I really am. I promise you I am. And then go my mom's. I love you, Dana. I will call you later. I have to run some. Okay, you got some runs me? Okay. I love you too, Mom. And um, thank you for coming in and showing some love. And I'll talk to you a little bit later too. Um, I'm gonna be doing an orientation all day. <laughs> I got 12 to 4 orientation with baby girl, so um, I'll definitely be talking to you later on after that. And uh, enjoy the errands. And I will talk to you later. Thanks for coming. I really appreciate it. I really, really do. I love you too, and uh, thanks for everything. And let me see who's everybody coming in. Okay, so everybody can subscribe. Um, let's do it, guys. And I'm so sorry you're not feeling good, it's Butterfly Jen. But we're gonna keep on praying. We're gonna keep on praying, but God know that you uh, are not gonna be defeated. You're gonna be get up there. You're gonna say, you know what? I'm not gonna take it today. Today is not gonna be that day. I'm gonna deal with this pain. I'm gonna get up. And I'm gonna go do some basketball. I'm gonna get up and go take me a walk. I'm gonna go up and sit on this porch. Whatever you gotta do, you're gonna get up and you're gonna be. You got this. Okay. So we're going to get to this craft. I think it's just time for craft iron. I think it is. So what we're going to do is get myself into the YouTube channel. Okay. Everybody say, hey, it's Jeannie. Yes, that's Jeannie. Lord. So I got to drop my link and I got to get myself up here so I can see my hands. Excuse me. Then I gotta pray that I got my. I don't even. I didn't get to bring my light up here because everything's downstairs because we had to move everything. Oh, there goes Jamie. Thank you, Lord. Jamie, I had a whole dance for you, and I was wondering why you didn't respond. I thought you were in already. So thank you, Jamie, for being here. How, how are you? Coming in. Thanks for the craft hour for coming in. So Jamie's one of our amazing members. If you don't have a grabber up, Jamie, you won the membership wheel last month for for last month last week. All right, we spun the wheel last week. We spun the wheel last week. Pertaining to the month of May. You won that wheel. Your channel will be getting promoted this month. So that means this month you'll be celebrating 700 subscribers, Jamie, ever at Jamie's Hook. Congratulations. Thank you for being a member. I appreciate you for being a part of this membership team and trusting me with your channel and just loving me. And I love you too. And uh, congratulations. <laughs> congratulations. You deserve it. I'm so happy for you. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and. Uh, let's go ahead and do that. Because we're not going to do that. Um, so let's keep going here. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and... Is that, sorry, Dan. Thank you, Danny, for helping me. For helping us grow not only our channels, but also our craft. Wow, Brenda, come on in here. Lord, this young lady's about to hit 3K. Hi! Guys, I was watching Brenda all night. Oh, my God, Brenda. Y'all run her playlist, guys. We're about to see her gra graduate to monetization mode. Brenda, you deserve it. We love you, Brenda. Her command is exclamation mark, Brenda. Every Tuesday at 3 p.m., we get to see her live. And I will sleep when it, Brenda, I feel so bad. That's like Tuesday is my, one of my favorite days. Like you see my family. And I literally passed out. I don't even know. Well, like I said, I was trapped up in the bedroom because the carpet was still wet. We had no furniture in here. Everything was in the kitchen, piled up on top of each other. So I just stayed up in the bedroom. 
Next thing I fell asleep, I wake up, Joe's gone, the kids are outside. I said, oh, Lord, I slept my nail in. So I'm sorry, Brenda. Now I'm downstairs. Joe's like, hey, I got to put a couple pieces of furniture in here. Like, we got to sit on something. Like, <laughs> I was like, okay. Because I don't know if they're coming back to replace or reclean. I don't know what they're doing. They, they told us nothing. So we don't know what's going on, but we'll see. Um, but let's get into this crap. Let me see what kind of stuff I'm going to get. What I got? G Hook? Let's try G Hook. We'll see. Um, he said, Yes, Dana and Brenda's. Um, thank God for the love. I appreciate y'all. Y'all have no idea. I appreciate y'all very, very much. Okay. And listening and doing some housework earlier. I was working on designing my crossbody phone, but oh, I got to see that. So is this going to be a written pattern? Jamie, let me know. I know everybody loves their tutorials, but I, we got to work on this passive income. You know, we've been talking about that on the members' meetings. We got to talk about the passive income where we got to find some things to do, guys. So I hope it's going to be a paid pattern so we can put you on the wheel. And then when we win stuff, I'll purchase it and then somebody can get it sent out to them. All right. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. And uh, hey, says Jeanette, DOY Life is in the building. Come on in here. How are you doing, says Jeanette? AKA Soraya. Come on in here. How are you doing today? I'm so glad to have you here. And uh, you guys are the best. What's going on? Did you hear me about that, Jamie? That you're going to be uh, getting 700. We're going to be working on your channel and help you to gain your next goal. Uh, I don't know if you heard that. We got 29. We're going to hit those thumbs up. We're about to get into our crap, guys. This is crap hour time. We're about to get into that crap. Let's do it. Let's do it. All right. Let's get into the crap, guys. Let's see here. All right, before we got to get out, let's see. I got to drop my link. And where are we at? Invite. Oh, you at work? Okay. It says ZOY is working. All right, so I'm going to drop this link so I can get in here and come on in and get my craft on mm -hmm. so y'all can see what I'm up to. All right. And uh, I'm super excited because a lot of the family has been doing this, guys. They said, you know what? We got to get into doing. Hey, welcome in, BND. Welcome in. He said, do you know by chance? No, I do not know by chance when you begin your Jogo prize. But uh, just be keep on watching out. When they come, they will be there. I'll let you know uh, if I get any shipping information. And uh, yes, yes, yes. Okay, so let's see here what we're going to do. Um, what are we going to do here? Yeah. I'm going to be putting get my link, get in here. Okay, yes, I'm continuing. Okay, so I'm just link here. Can you see the hub? Huh? Can you see the hub? Come on. Oh, earlier, I guess, maybe so. That's what I'm changing my mind. Let's see. Where's that? Sorry, guys. Hold on. Wait a minute. Okay, so we're in the building now, and we're about to get ready to start this craft, okay? And we're going to have some fun and the sun. And let me move this on up. Oh, you probably knew that. Oh. No, nothing. I said you probably knew that. That was from yesterday. Yeah. Okay, let's see. Let's get to You said, love my people. said, Jeannie. Yes, I know. We have withdrawal. Say it again. Everybody said, we said, we're having withdrawal versus Jeannie alone. But I know she, we know she's busy. You know, she got to handle business. So she said she's going to try to do a video at least. She's doing so much, guys. Not only she's doing stuff for her own channel, but she's doing stuff to help others. So it gets it gets a lot. It gets really really tedious. I'm telling you, it gets crazy. So Jenny, you better see. You better start seeing some stuff that I be dealing with. Because I always say, guys, hey, I'm gonna try to do a video, and you're like, damn, where? Y'all you? Yeah, probably just don't even think about it to do a video somewhere. You're like, yeah, damn. Yep. Whenever we do a video, yeah, we'll we'll. Mm -hmm. But we're not gonna say that for Sis Jenny. Sis Jenny is a lot more, you know, a lot more disciplined than me. Okay. So, but yeah, it, once you get so many different things going on. The organization has to happen, and then you got to get an assistant. And when you get an assistant, you're good. So that's the thing. We're going to be praying for assistance in this season. Uh, not only for Sajini, but for me too, a lot. <laughs> okay, so let's get into our craft for today. All right, sorry about that, guys. I hope he's in there uh, doing a little rinse job. Okay. Let's get it loud. 
Okay. Sorry about that, guys. It'll be done in one second. And I'll get in here for the craft very shortly. So just rinse out a cup for some coffee making. No, yeah, just a little bit. I don't know. Just pressure is just real up there. Never mind, guys. I'll just go ahead and get in because we got to get out of here. Um, You say guest, Connie. Guest host with Connie will be 7 p.m. Central. Tonight, you say I'll be a guest host on the 16th of June. Oh, my God. That's going to be fun. Yes, it's Jeannie's going to be. Uh, her birthday is this month as well on the 29th. Woo -woo. We got two birthdays that I know of. Sis Jeannie's on the 29th and Stephanie at Five and Stitches on the 23rd, which is the same day as our um, anniversary, nine years of being married. Hey, Tina. Welcome in, sis. Tina, Tinsy loves, Tinsy loves Jesus forever. Come on in here. All right, so let's go ahead and get into this, guys. Let's get into the craft before we go to Kim's house, because we're going over to Kim's house, guys. Okay. So I'm going to slide this down a little bit. And I'm going to tilt, maybe. Do I need to tilt myself in? Uh, let's see. Okay. So I'm going to slide this down a little bit. Okay. Every time I start crocheting, guys, you always get those little tickly fibers that you got to deal with. All right. So let's go ahead and get into our craft for today. All right. So I'll grab a little bit of some cotton. This is Hobby Lobby. I love this cotton. Like a lavender's color. Oh, thanks for joining. I appreciate you coming in and join. Even though you're trying to work, you need to grind on, you're still working. I'm going to I went to Louisiana this weekend and celebrate my Father's Day early with my daddy. I might do a pop-up. Oh, yes, please do a pop-up live. We want to see you meet your dad. That'd be a blessing. Yes, yes, yes. We want to meet dad. Say so, Jeannie, yeah. Oh, Dana, do you know? I am getting Sister Jane's notification, which is why I have her bill ring. Why are you not getting Um, I'm not sure. She hasn't been doing live streams lately, so maybe that's why. She hasn't been doing any. She's been having a lot of, every single week when it's time for a live stream, something's been going on so far as having some business to handle or, you know, I'm trying to get caught up. It's like what we're doing. You know, you're trying to get caught up. Housework has to be done. Renovation works. All kinds of things is getting done. And so it's been happening on those Fridays. So, you know, so. Um, we're hoping maybe this week she'll have the time and she'll be because she even have doctor visits and stuff too. So we'll pray that she'll be able to get them in. Okay. And since Jeannie's, if you're talking about, yeah, try yeah, try to unsubscribe, resubscribe, hit the bell as well. And also, if you can, uh, like Granny D does, she puts an alarm on her phone. YouTube has their own rules and what they do. So what well, Granny D does, she'll put an alarm on her phone, like it's a, you know, she'll go in and say, hey, um, she'll say, just like a doctor's appointment, 7 p.m. Eastern. I mean, 8 p.m. Eastern, 7 p.m. Central, Sis Jeannie's live. And guess what she does? She has it, and then goes off on her phone. So, and then she just goes to Sis Jeannie. She knows Sis Jeannie's on me on. Hey, there she goes. We're making that. We're going to make a mug rug lawn. If I can get myself in here. That's my niece, guys. She's in a building. We're going to be training about what? 10, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. All right, so let's do our train of 10. Okay. Let me see. Two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven. I want to do ten or eleven. Uh, let's do ten. So let's go ahead and single crochet in each chain across. How you doing, Gigi? That's our niece, my niece, and uh, her command is exclamation mark Gigi. She helps out so much with editing, making intros. Guys, this young lady is a the bomb. dot com. And if you do need an intro, guys, we're talking like, sorry about that, guys. If you do need about maybe 30, uh, um, 30, a 30 second intro or something like that, guys, feel free to check her out on her channel where you'll be able to um, grab a, a beautiful intro and you can tell her what you want done. You can send in about seven pictures. You can tell her what the captions you want the captions to say. If you already have a sound that you are choosing, you can choose a sound um, or she can find one for you. Um, I'm just telling you, this young lady is amazing. So the Christmas and July period is coming up. Many of y'all are going to be needing your videos edited because last year, some people never get their videos edited because you didn't want to go through all that hassle. And I understand. So this young lady will have all kinds of different things that you can support her in. Um, you can email her. She has her email address in her about tab and you can get the prices. Like I said, $30 for intros. I'm not sure how much editing a video would be because that takes way longer. Um, but I know if you do want an intro, many of us want something to start our channels off with. People watch our videos. Like, oh, I need me an intro. I need some kind of catchy. 
or people can see it, people can enjoy it. You know, I want something like that. And she's very, very, very good. She's working on crocheting her first ever blanket while watching me. Oh my gosh, JJ, I can't wait to see this blanket. I love this channel. It's so colorful. Thank you so much, sis Tina. I appreciate you. I really, really do. Okay. I really, really, really do. Okay, let's see here. And let me see. Let me make sure I got this right, guys. Okay. All right. Let me make sure I didn't write my chain. I don't really know. Oh, I was supposed to be chain of 16. Help me along. I did a chain of 11. Okay, let's do a chain of 16. This is 10, 11, it's 12. 13, 14, 15, and 16. Okay. I know I was doing something wrong. Okay? I'm sorry. So I got my chain of 16 here, guys, with this purple yarn. Really nice. Hobby Lobby. I love Hobby Lobby's yarn, okay? And I love it. I truly, truly do. How are you feeling today, huh? You feeling a little bit better? Is it a lot better right now? It's over now. A bit better now? Good. All right. So now we got our 16, and what we're going to do is... Okay. Okay. Sorry, guys. I'm looking at my own store right now. Okay. Are we gonna single crochet on these hoops? We single crochet. Okay. So single crochet all the way down. That's what I thought we were doing. With that. So I wasn't sure. Okay. So let me go and see what everybody's saying in the chat. But this new phone, guys, I can't see the chat. Can y'all believe it? It's not taking over. See my old phone would take over and it would let me be the person. And so that's what I think I'm dealing with as well with the feedback sometimes when uh, we have other people up because it's like I'm a guest as well. I don't want to be a guest. I want to be the person. You know what I'm trying to say? So I think I need to do a stream on YouTube. I think I need to do a stream. I mean, I think I need to do go log in on stream right on here. I'm the, I don't think I'm logged in. Yeah, it's probably what's wrong. Yeah. Mine go up as ready. Yeah, so I need to log in. Cause like I can't see the stream. Like I used to be able to read here, and I wanted to, you know, I could do other things on the computer. So let's go ahead and uh, let's keep going. Yeah, it's, it's a it's a giant granny square. Like, oh, that's gonna be good. Those are always great to do. You just start off with one granny square and then keep going, and then GG, you can make some other granny squares and send out to your people. Oops, I didn't mean to say that. I didn't mean to say that. But you were supposed to send out twenty nine years. I didn't. Ago. I didn't mean to say that. Okay. Welcome in, Miss Beth. How you doing? Thanks for being here. We love you, Miss Bev. Thank you for being here. We appreciate the love and support. If you don't have baby scrappy plans, please grab her up. We appreciate you, Miss Bev. She's been doing really great things on our channel. She's been doing some great crafting time. She's been doing a lot of crafting things, guys. If you don't have her, please grab her up and show her some sweet love. We have the beautiful Kelly Crochet Adventures in the building. Welcome in, Kelly. How are you doing today? Thank you for being here, Kelly. Kelly's in the building. And I'm telling you, she's having some great streams as well. We got to go to Kelly's house over her house last night. Kelly's been doing some beautiful work. Oh, and putting out great videos. She was live today at 12 30 p.m. Eastern. That's right. I'm so excited. Hey Coco. Coco's in the building. She's on that gold squad. If you don't have her, please grab her up. Oh my gosh. What's going on, Coco? Kelly's command is exclamation mark Kelly with an I. Coco's command is exclamation mark Coco. All right. So let's go show some love to all of our members. Good morning to you all. I'm so happy to have y'all here. So, so happy to have y'all here, guys. What amazing time. Okay. So we're gonna start a sing, um we're gonna start in the second chain, going in single chain. Okay. Then we're gonna chain one and turn, and we're gonna do skip the first, single crochet in the next, and double in the same. Hey, baby, I saw some wild pictures in the chat. Wow. Okay. And everybody's Kelly saying hello there, everybody. Okay, so guys, what we're going to do is a single crochet in the first stitch. So, okay, let me start over, guys. Sorry about that. We're going to do a... We have our single crochets around. What we're going to do next is turn. Or we're going to chain one and turn. We're going to skip the first stitch. And in the second stitch, we're going to do a single crochet. And we're going to do a double crochet. All right, so that's how we're going to do that. Then we're going to skip one. We're going to single crochet. And then we're going to double crochet. This is going to be a mug rug or like a coaster. Okay. 
So you're just going to skip one and do the same thing all the way across. If you do want to see this tutorial, I will have a link to the tutorial. And uh, you guys can go there and watch it. I would appreciate you guys to watch that. These make beautiful gifts. Beautiful, amazing, fun gifts. Or you can make these for the family. You can make them in baskets. If you make like any teas or anything like that, guys. Or if you have some coffee for somebody in the family. And they like coffee or you know anything like that. They have a housewarming. You can make something like this for them. And they'll be like, oh, thank you. So like I said, it's just going to be like a, a coaster type of ordeal. I'm going to drop a link. If you guys want to go watch the tutorial, you can, you are more than welcome to watch it. Okay? You are more than welcome to enjoy this. Um, enjoy this. And uh, this is one of my tutorials, guys. Um, and you guys can definitely go watch it and enjoy it. And uh, see what we have going on if you guys are interested. Very, very easy. It is very beginner friendly. I like to do tutorials that are beginner friendly. So that way everybody can enjoy. Okay? So all you're going to be doing is skipping one. And then you're going to single in one stitch. And you're going to double crochet in the same stitch. Very, very simple. You're going to skip one and do all the way around. So skip one, single here. Okay? Just like so. All the way down. All right? I think I did have one extra. Oopsie. I must have had one extra stitch, but no worries, guys. Okay? Let's chain one. Let's go again. And we're going to... Do the same thing. Skip this double. And we're going to make sure I got this right. All right. Let me make sure I got it right. That is right. All right. Skip that one. And we're going to. Oh, we're not going to skip anything. Oh, we are. Okay. We're going to single here. Okay. And then double. Okay. So that's what we are going to do. So we're just going to. Uh, skip the first stitch, and we're going to do the same exact thing all the way down. All the way down. We're just going to work in the singles only. Single crochet and double. And the single crochet is only. So we're always going to skip the double crochet. And we're going to single crochet and double crochet. And the single crochet is only. It's been a while since I made it. I used to make this all the time, guys. And I would have them for gifts. And uh, I think I'm going to go back to making some of these up as gifts, too, guys, like little sets. Because these used to be really good for fun to have made up. Okay, so let's go over here. And in the single crochets only, we'll work a single and a double. That's all we're doing. Very, very simple. And you can see texture. I don't know if y'all are texture fans like me, but I'm a big fan of texture. Very big fan of it. So you're just going to keep going all the way down. And you can do about 10 rows of this. Uh, or depending, on, depending on how many rows you would like to do, you can do 10, you can do more, however you choose, you can do more of those rows, guys. But these are very, very, uh, very easy to make up. Okay, so you skip this one, and you're just going to single and double in the next. Let's see what everybody is saying. Everybody just enjoying the chat. Thank you so much for being here. And thank each and every one for the thumbs up. We do have 29 here. Thank you all so much for coming. All right. So, yes, yes, yes. And that's all you're going to do all the way back and forth. Guys. That's why I love this pattern. It's very simple. Look at that texture, guys. Look at that beautiful texture. Once you get your desired amount of rows, what we'll do is we're going to be adding fringe to the edges. And uh, or we'll put it, we'll have this be here. Depending on the seat, we'll see how long it's going to be. But you're going to put your fringe down your edges, and then this is going to be, a, it's going to resemble a bit of a rug, but it is going to be like a coaster, okay? And I like the, you don't have to add your, you don't have to add any type of fringe if you don't like it. I know fringe can be uh, sometimes a nightmare, <laughs> but it is, uh, it does add that kind of like a rustic boho or bohemian look, whatever you want to call it. It kind of gives a nice little flair. And uh, so you guys can use that. Hey, Carter's eats in the building. Welcome in. How you doing today? Thanks for coming. <laughs> so happy to have you. So happy to have you. I'm so glad everybody's here. Y'all are the best family ever. We have 30 in the building. If you haven't hit the thumbs up, please do it. Today we're making a coaster or a mug rug. So I put our beautiful coffee cups on. We're having our coffee, our teas. We need something to rest it on. And it doesn't have to be, you know, the, just the traditional 
uh, the traditional coaster, traditional mug rugs. We can have these babies customized. And what will be great about these is these are different seasons of stuff coming up, right? We got a lot of sport fans. Why not have different colors of these for our sport fans? You know, for different type of teams. You got your baseball, your football, your hockey, your, whatever teams that you support. You can make these babies up, and these can be great for Father's Day. All right? Our hobbies, some of your hobbies like to have your coffee. They like to have their beers, whatever they're drinking. I don't know. But these could be great for hubby's day, Father's Day. Make up the different team colors and get them their mug rugs, okay? And if you don't use this particular pattern, you still can use different ones. Put the sports team to it. This is great for Father's Day. Um, so make their different mugs up or their rugs up and do something nice. You know, you can do those type of things. All right, guys? So let's keep going in. And uh, let's go along. You're about to color. Ooh. Okay, so Kim's going to be live at 11.10. Okay, Kim. So we're going to go raid Kim Law, and uh, she's going to be doing some Whip Wednesday. <clears throat> Excuse me, guys. So we're going to go to Kim's house today, guys, and for Whip Wednesday. Usually she'll let people come up if you do have a finished <coughs> object or if you have a whip that you're working on. Okay? So if you do have a whip that you're working on and you like to share it, please come up. But this is, that will be the time where you just share whips, Okay? I know it's been great to have everybody come up and have a good time on Kim's, but she does really try to have the Wednesdays for those who will be crafting. Uh, it's nothing rough or anything to be rude. It's just basically she really would like to share. A lot of people are coming to see whips. A lot of people are coming to see crafting. So if you do have a craft, please just come up and share it um, so that way everybody can enjoy the crafting. Um, and just, you know, that's what she really tries to keep her Wednesdays up to. Uh, but everyone is welcome most definitely. But if you do have a craft, uh, she would love to have you up to share, you know, how far is it going? If you're liking it, if you're not liking it, uh, <laughs> you know, things of that sort, because she has so many whips, you know, and that's just, that's just, that's what it is. It's nothing. Um, and like I said, it's just, you know, her, that's what a whip Wednesday is. And um, it's, nothing, it's nothing rough about that. But a lot of people are, you know, just there to come and have a good time. And there's nothing wrong with, you know, having a good time, but just on a Wednesday so we could keep it to bringing up that whip or the yarn. The yarny goodness, as we want to see, there is knitting, crochet. Um, you know, come up there and share because Kim will love. She loves to see what our family has going on. She's newly monetized. You want to come donate to keep her channel going because uh, YouTube is a lot of work, and she loves to have these videos. But I mean, we would love to be if we can donate to her to keep things going for her, um, where she'll be able to get yarns and crafts and uh, be able to do some shopping for us, and she can show share with us what yarn and stuff is really like. Before we have to spend our money on it, she, she'll let us know, hey, this is a good buy, guys. This is a good one. So, Linda says, I'm going to be lurking a lot. Yeah, you're going to prep for a lot. Yes, you do. Yes, because we're going to be raiding Linda Law. We're going to raid Kim after this. And then we're going to raid Linda Law after that. <laughs> so, a whole day of raiding, guys. A whole day of raiding. And I'm excited to go and see what everybody's working on. Linda's going to be working on new socks. Kim is the queen of socks. Kim has me doing socks myself. I'm like, really, Kim? You're doing this to me? But I have everything for socks. I just have to get myself to doing it. I don't know if it's a certain pattern I should ju jump into. I'm not sure yet. I'm really nervous about it because I don't know if I should do a certain pattern. If I just try to, you know, what, what kind of pattern would I, should I do for it? Okay, let's see here. How many rows? And... Let's see. Four inches exactly. And how many rows I did? I'm just gonna see how many rows I did, guys. So I don't. I can't remember how many rows I did. We're gonna do this. No, two, two. Ten total rolls. Okay, that's what I was thinking. You're gonna have ten total rolls for this one. That's nice yarn. We're use. Oh, I'm using Hobby Lobby. I love this cotton. Hobby Lobby. I love this cotton, which I definitely adore. And Brenda, have you ever used the Burnett Softy Cotton? That's what I'm using to make my newest top. And I was just telling Helen J. She um, she recommended it, and I love it. It kind of gives me a feel of a bamboo, and there's no bamboo in it, but it gives me a bamboo feel. And Wolf is going to be giving his testimony on Brandon's 1 p.m. stream. What? 
get out of here. Oh, I can't wait. Oh my God, it's gonna be so powerful. Thank you so much, Gigi, for telling us. Oh my gosh, we gotta be there or be square. I definitely need to hear um Bro Wolf's testimony. That's amazing. I don't think I really heard. Well, I heard a little bit of it, you know, but it's different when you can just hear, you know, hear the full ordeal. It's going to be amazing. I can't wait. Let's see here. It's going to turn. We're going to continue so we have 10 rows. It's, it's really pretty easy. That's what I like about this pattern because it's really, really easy. So, and I do have the tutorial. Did I drop the tutorial? I think I did. I dropped the tutorial. So, you guys are going to be like, is your favorite? Really? I'm telling you. And I, and Joe bought me tons of it, guys, for Mother's Day. Um, so I have different colors to choose from. Um, he got me like maybe two, two of some colors, three of another. So I have a lot of stuff to choose from. And I made a hat with this one. So I had some left over. So I said, you know what? Let's play around with this and let's have some fun. And I'm going to be making some different totes. I have new totes that are coming out. And uh, I didn't realize how big my, hello, Jojo Juju. Come on in. Many of y'all know the amazing Jojo Juju, who is teaching us all how to get the most out of our knitting machines. Come on in, Jojo Juju. How are you doing today? Thanks for being here. Come on in. Today, I'm just making a mug rug or a coaster that you can add. After you get done, you add your fringe to these ends. So you'll keep going 10 inches for 10 rows. You'll have a total of four inches. You add your fringe here, and it'll give the... Uh, it will give the illusion of a rug if you put fringe on the end and you'll put your drink on there. Uh, and then, boop, there you go. <laughs> and uh, let's see. Everybody's showing some love. This is so satisfying. Oh, wow. Thank you, Carter Z, for saying that. I appreciate you. <laughs> Thank you for that. Uh, I try to do this every morning, 9.30 a.m. Eastern, where I just try to do a craft and I pray. Thank you, sir. I try to do a craft. I try to do a prayer first. And I greet everybody. And after I do the greeting, we get into a craft. Uh, sometimes it's a little chatty. I just do more chatting and crafting. <laughs> sometimes I do a little bit of a, a craft. But yes, Jojo Juju, you're always welcome here. I love your work. You know I do. Um, she's amazing, guys. And so uh, I've done one of our patterns already. Maybe I know, uh, which was her fingerless gloves. So I'm going to bring the Addy and stuff back out again, guys. It's been a while. Since we brought the Addy out and done some knit projects, right? It's been a while. So I'm going to go find something I can do within an hour's time and try to get it done. That's what we're going to do, okay? I'm going to go back and do some research, figure out what I can do. I've been so heavy writing patterns lately. I haven't had a chance to have some fun. Okay? So, yes, thank you so much. All right, so Rojo has planners up right now, guys. If anybody's wanting to grab up the planners, planners, okay, Jojo, you will love craft art. Is it? Oh, thank you, Jolene, for saying that. Jolene, you're so sweet. <laughs> Everybody loves this craft art, so I always try to do my best with it. Um, it's one of my goals to really um, bring you good, good content and spend this time with you all. This is one of my favorite things to do as well. I really, truly love it. Okay, so like I said, we're just gonna keep going. Let's see how many rows we have, guys. Um, I can't even count my rows right now. So this is two, four, six, and eight. So we need two more rows. Oh my gosh, look at that texture. I'm so, I'm, I'm gonna be honest, look at that texture. I don't know if y'all like texture or not, but I, I absolutely adore texture. I absolutely adore it. Okay, so let's just keep on going. Yes, our beautiful niece Gigi does live streams. God's Girl Creations. That's my beautiful niece. She does live streams on Mondays and Thursdays at 8.30 a.m. Eastern for Coffees in Christ. Many of y'all have been there, so y'all know what I'm talking about. For those who haven't had a chance to go over there, oh, you need some prayer, you want some fellowship, you want to hear a nice message, you can get right over to our house and get it. Fellowship with so many fun people. And then also on uh, Saturdays at 11 a.m. Eastern, it's a Bible study time. You can come up if you want to sing, have a testimony. She'll be giving a word that God has given her. We'll study, we'll talk about it. It's a blast. It's a blast. Thank you so much, Jojo. Juju. So, what you working on, Jojo? Anything new? Well, I know it is. 
I know it's something new. And Jojo Juju, I was looking at your um video. I have to go see. I have to go be nosy. I said, like, Jojo, I need to know. I need to get a central on that size first because I have a different uh, brand and I want to get a smaller central like that. Um, and I was thinking of how you had it clamped. You know, your small central. You had it clamped. I'm like, I love it. I don't have that. Um, you work a lot of hours. Oh, oh you saw me. I'm sorry. You, may, you usually get your grind on, no, no worries. You'll be back to it. I know you got to get your grind on, but you'll be back to your, your videos and stuff. But um, I just wanted to say that because I'm like, I see the way that you, um, thank you for that blessing, Melissa. Woo -hoo! We got a super chat from the beautiful Melissa. Thank you so much. Oh my goodness, guys. We got to show some love to Melissa. Representing Melissa Crochets with love. If we can drop her link. Is a stool. I saw the stool. He said the small one. I attached it with a belt on a stool. Oh, it's a belt. I was like, what is this? I'm like, what is this? I love how you do that. I, I'm gonna I'm gonna eventually get my um small centro too as well. And we're gonna drop Melissa's link because she sent us a super chat. Thank you. And I gotta put your name on my wheel. Because we're gonna be doing some more. Like I said, I love to do knitting machine work. Jojo makes it so easy. I always make sure I link her back in, tag her in. Um, because I really want people to see what she has going on. Y'all yeah, can get to our channel. And then, uh, Melissa, your name is going to be like all over this super chat wheel. What is going on, Melissa? <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you, God, for everything you're doing. Oh, God. Thank you. Melissa, you're just, you just want your name all over this thing. I really believe it. I really believe it. You do. <laughs> and I appreciate you so, so much. And, uh, let's see here. You said, I took my little one. Oh, you took your little one's belt. Mm. Don't mind if I do. I, I know my little one has a couple of belts I might be to grab blind. <laughs> oh my goodness. And I got to see how to do it. I have to see how to do it, guys. So we're almost done with this. And again, uh, we'll be heading over to Kim shortly. So if anybody can be on the lookout, she said about 11.10. So we have like one minute. Oh, it's actually 11.10 now. So we'll see if she's on. And again, after you get done with this part, guys, if you watch my tutorial, you'll see I add fringe. So this ends here. So you'll see this is one more row, okay? And then we'll begin to add fringe here. And it'll be a beautiful rug, okay? You can cut your fringe. I usually cut about 50 pieces. You cut 50 pieces, and you're going to add so many per side, okay? And it comes out really, really gorgeous. Again, make these babies in different colors. I like to see them. Post them in my crochet group, Creatively Creative Crocheters, and join over there and share with me what you're working on. Hey, welcome in. My beautiful sister Liz is in the building. Hello, we love you. Welcome in. Thank you for coming in, and I appreciate you for being here. If you don't have this young lady, please grab her up and give her some hugs as well as some kisses. She served our country. She's mothering. She's wifing. She's daughtering. She's grandmothering, and she's doing so much more. So I appreciate you, sister, for being here. We love you, love you, love you. And her command is exclamation mark. Liz, she's on that pearl spot. All right, go show her some sweet love. We have our cousin Angie. She says, good morning, fam. Happy Wednesday to all my crafty heroes. We love you. This young lady is amazing as well. Shout out to you, cuz. How are you feeling today? Uh, thank you. You are amazing. You are the bomb.com. And uh, if you don't have this young lady, please grab her up. She'll be having some things to sell. We'll be able to purchase, do some reviews on it, and show some love for everybody um, in the building. So y'all go over to her house, and uh, we love you so much. That's my cousin. She's over at Loving Every Stitch by Ruby, baby. All right. Last week, I couldn't say a lot. I was, I was groggy. This week, I got, I got to get it out. So we're going to be hanging over to Kim's. I'm going to see if she's ready. Um, so we can go say triple C Ray to Kim's house because then we're going to have Linda after that. All right. We got Minister Music who's live as well. We want to hit that link for Minister Music. Show him some love. All right. Minister Music. All right. Hey, Minister Music. Minister of me. Tomorrow's his birthday, guys. All right. So I'm going to show some money, Mr. Music. Had to do that. Hit that like button. Do, do, do. All right. Let's see if Kim's Crochet and Knits is live and on. All right. Let's see Kim's Crochet and what? Knits. Is she ready for us yet? Okay. She's not ready for us yet. But I'm going to get the link ready so we can go and say triple C Ray. Okay. We're going to say triple C Ray. Triple C Ray. Okay, and I'm going to get the link ready, so she'll be shortly. She'll be with us shortly. She's getting all set up. So we're going to copy that link, and we're going to get ready for the 
Ray, you said, what's Kim's link again? I'm going to drop it right now. So I'm going to do it right now, guys, for anybody who's going to come over there with me. The triple C Ray. Okay, and she's on. So let's do this. Drop this link. We're going to paste that, baby. Y'all grab this link. We're going to Kim's house. We're headed there for Whip Wednesday. Please bring your whips and let's go have some fun. If y'all have anything that y'all working on, y'all want to share it. Please come up on the panel and bring the whips. We're going to keep it crafty today over at Kim. So come on up there and let's show some beautiful works. I can't wait to see y'all there. We love y'all. Have a beautiful day. Be blessed. Sleep time with the baby was bite. Um, hey, Sister G, I love you too, Sister Law. You know, I missed you yesterday, Law. All right, guys. So we're going to get out of here. Take care and have a beautiful day. See you over at Kim's. Take care. Thank you for joining me again for Craft Hour Triple C. See you later.